Okay, I got it. I mean, I suppose to free up some time, he'd cancel Jamie Blonde. I, of course, you know, one of the actors is currently missing and- No, no, like, we're not, we're not canceling Jamie Blonde, we're not canceling anything. What? Like, well, I know you're back and all, and you're still sort of new, but you can't seriously consider canceling a very popular show. The ratings are good, and the storyline is very well put together. I'm pretty sure you would crush Piper and Clockwork if you just, you know, canceled it. I guess you're right, but we can't really get any new episodes released because Mason Bombshell is kind of MIA at the moment. You're right, we can't film any new episodes right now, but we can't cancel it either. Ugh, fine. Hmm. I know. Tell me about it. In all honesty though, clockwork, I mean, we have other options. I suppose you're right, but I just didn't want to end it like this. What we have doesn't have to be over, it's just, it has to take a break. We have to take a break. And what are we supposed to move on to? Other things. We have to move on. You're right, we just can't continue this story. Quite a shame if you ask me, because honestly, I thought it was going very well. Well, we can blame Griffin for this one. Can't we blame Griffin for everything? <laughs> why not? But honestly, what was he thinking putting Mason Bombshell's actor on a ship? A what? I mean, you know, like, like a cruise, not a, not a ship ship. You had me confused. Uh, I guess we have to do something else. Well, I hear Uptown needs a new storyline. Ugh, that show. I mean, I honestly don't know what we can do to pick that thing up. We could end it. Yes, we could end it, but it has to be wrapped up in a good way. I mean, I don't know how to do that. Good point. Huh. Oh, Dakota. Hi, Shyla. I was wondering if, um... Well, is everything okay? Yes, there was just something that I wanted to talk to you about. Oh, what is it? Well, you see, for a long time now, I've... Ugh, you've got to be kidding me! I can't believe he just did this! Rin, is everything okay? No, everything is not okay, Dakota. I can't believe what Griffin just did. What did he do? <sighs> Ugh, I can't... Just... Rin. Okay. You... You know, I've been making costumes for the past few weeks. It's been taking everything that I have. Now Griffin all of a sudden decides to interview new cast today. And unfortunately, I need costumes ready because he thinks that they will be perfect for the part. But doesn't he have to interview them first? They're callbacks, so they might as well already be in the bag. But I can't because you have to understand how long it takes for one piece of clothing to be made, let alone several costumes, and he wants them done by the end of the day. I don't know why, perhaps they're ready to shoot something, which I don't know what because as far as I know Jamie Blonde is on hold and everything else is kind of, you know, just everywhere. Rin. It's not like this is the first time he's done this. You know, beyond the portal, he had done something similar, but in my castle. He brought a group of people through my castle, just to look around, just to bug me. Can you believe he did something like that? I mean, I was astounded, and what could I do? I would look so rude in front of everyone. I couldn't actually say anything. I bet you remember it. It was such a bad day. Actually, this is why I live on the mountains, in a separate island, specifically for the reason to stay away from your little kingdom. Little kingdom, huh? First of all, regardless of what island you think you might be on, you're still under one of our reigns. So technically, you're a part of the kingdom either way. You're right, but lucky for me, I don't have to worry about it. Rin, you sound like you're very... What, jealous? 
jealous of all the time Griffin's spending trying to, you know, upset me instead of doing something nice? Well, guess what, Shyla? I am not jealous. I don't care what he does, but I do care when it affects me in a negative way. I was going to say stressed. Maybe you should go home and take a nap, rejuvenate, and then come back with a clear head. That way you'll be able to work on things better. What? And give Griffin the satisfaction of him knowing that I had to bail out? How unprofessional. It's not unprofessional, Rin. You're just thinking that it is. It's much more professional than making really bad looking costumes because you're too tired. I don't expect you guys to know everything. Why are you even here? Ugh. Okay. So what was that you were going to tell me? Oh, well... Ah, uh, Shyla? Sorry to interrupt. Shyla, I was wondering if I could borrow you for a little while? Sure. What do you need? Well, Piper and I are finally getting some good ideas for a new series, but we need to make sure that there is space available. And we also need some rough sketches of a new set so that we have something to work with. Of course. I think there's some space available at the bottom level. I can go scout and I'll let you know. I'll drop some sketches and then I'll give them to you. Thank you. That would be brilliant. Alright, well, um, I'll see you later. Sorry about that. I have to go. Of course. I understand. <sighs> okay, so maybe instead we could go with... Shyla, where are you going? Things to do, places to go, people to see. See, now at least she's getting something done. We could be getting something done too. Ugh, but it's so hard. I can't get anything. Just, I have all these ideas and stuff, but just none of them would work. You know that you say that about every good idea you've ever had. Do I really? Yep. Huh. But still, none of them would actually work. You can be really difficult sometimes. Yeah? Well, so can you. That's a good point. I'm not going to hold you against that. 